In this video tip, I'm going to show you how to lay out the four corners of your cabin footprint so they're perfectly square to each other. It's not that easy, but with this little trick, you'll be able to get it perfect every time. This is the footprint of the cabin, and the narrow end equals 16 feet, and that's 192 inches. And the long end equals 25 feet, that's including the porch, or 300 inches. Your first step is to mark the location of the two corners at one end of the cabin, and that's 16 feet apart. Next, take a long tape measure and extend it from one of these points all the way out to where you think that other wall of the cabin should be. Now, you don't know exactly where to place that tape, and that's what this exercise is all about. Just keep your eye on the 25-foot mark at the end of the tape. Now, next, grab another long tape and extend it from the other corner so that it intersects the first tape. Now we know from the Pythagorean theorem that the length of the diagonal of a rectangle like this should be 29 feet 8 and 3 16 inches. And that's the number that you want to look at at the end of that tape. When the 25 foot mark on one tape intersects with the 29 foot 8 and 3 16 inch mark on the other tape, then you've got a perfectly 90 degree corner way back here, next to one of the corners that you marked earlier. Now, you'll need another 90 degree corner, but the process is pretty much the same. You extend one tape out along where you think that wall should be, keep your eye on the 25 foot mark, and then extend the other tape, that magic 29 feet, 8 and 3 16 inches, out so it intersects the first tape. 